Good afternoon, Michele. My name is Paul. Hi, Paul. My name is Paul Marciano. Michele, come? Morone. 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 Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet it's you. a very good pleasure for me. A pleasure. <laughs> what a pleasure that we are here together. Yeah. Are we in paradise here? Well, that's one of the most beautiful places I've ever seen in my life. The same for me, Lake Como behind me. Yeah, and this is a beautiful palace where we are here. Yeah. I'm fascinated by your story because in my career, I've never seen something like that to happen to anybody so fast, so crazy. And of course, people are going to say, oh, you know, if this is a world of social media, this and that. No. Even on that, it doesn't exist. Because I met you like only three weeks ago, and you had like two million five, two million five hundred thousand. One point seven. The very first time, one point seven million, and it was three weeks ago. Yeah. Today we are three weeks later. Eight point six. You're almost nine million in <laughs> three weeks. Explain me why is that craziness? Well, Paul, like, I mean, um, first of all, um, I think it's it's. It's the point is the movie, I guess, because uh, the movie was released on Netflix around one month ago, one month that's and it, a half yeah. ago. Yeah, that's it. And it went worldwide, so in over two hundred countries all all around the world. And uh, two hundred countries, more than two hundred. Wow, countries all around the world. And I was uh, at and it's still in the top ten in each families and uh, people. Appreciate that movie, and uh, everything ran that so fast just because because of okay, that, and not only for that because for the movie also I wrote the soundtracks of the movie. All the songs of the movie are mine. So, so the everything was a combo. Of the movie has been done by you. Yeah, yeah. Everything was a combo between the acting of Massimo Torricelli and yeah. the soundtrack. So nobody ever did something like that. Was the main character writing the. Uh, writing the the soundtrack of the movie. And did you sing on a movie? Yeah. And you play the music also. Exactly. And it's your lyrics. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> but still, I want to understand because the level of engagement you have is off the chart. Mm -hmm. I mean, people have millions of followers, and I cannot tell you the name. Some big ones that work with me, but they are at a fraction of yeah. your engagement. Yeah. Your engagement is at the point when you had four million, you had one million three hundred, one million five hundred like, which is an engagement That's a crazy unheard. Thing. Yeah, like for example now. Why people are so crazy about? Is it the movie? Is it you? Is it your voice? I mean, is it your body? I, I think it's a combo of everything. I mean, if we're thinking, you know, like the movie Massimo Torricelli is already a, a, a very interesting character. Plus, take Massimo Torricelli singing for the movie. Well, that's a very big, big wow. combo. Of, it's an artistic big combo. You know, okay. And uh, it's, it's. And then the story is very intriguing. Yeah, it's very it's very intriguing because you know this this Massimo Torricelli who fell in love with uh, fell in love with Laura and okay. um, you know he he kidnapped her. Uh, you know this. And people love that mystery. Yeah, it's it's a combo between love, mystery, and of course, erotism. Yeah, of course. And uh, it's a combo of everything. Oh, so let me go to something else. What if I tell you today you are younger than 30 years old and this success is coming to you? What is that you can remember of one of the best memory as a kid? Best memory of the ki of a of kid your, when I had you. it was me hanging the neck of my dad while he was swimming in the in the sea. Wow! I used to he used to take me. Uh, and how old you were? He used to take me on the sea swimming with them, but I didn't know how to swim because I was little. You were little. And he used to uh, help me out to swim. And this is the best memory because I, I lost my dad when I was 11 years old. And uh, oh, wow. if I if I think about that, I I still feel. The smell of the sea, the smell you of do. the skin of my dad, because and this that's, combo, you know, that stays in your in your yeah, it gets, memory. It got stuck in my head, yeah, yeah. And what is your your fear? What is your worst fear? The worst fear is sharks. 
<laughs> don't go, don't go to Australia. <laughs> no, no, I want, no, I want to go to Australia. My baby, not swimming yes, in brown yes. shorts. So when we met, I was, I was shocked how many people were following us, and I could not understand because it never happened to me, not once. And people were following us everywhere. We went in a hotel, people follow us. We went in a restaurant, people follow us. We went in a street, people follow us. How do you do that? I mean, does it, is it a shock for you to have so much attention? And, and when uh, six months ago, nobody knew you. Yeah, but even because last year, today, last year, I was a gardener. <laughs> you were what? A gardener. A gardener. Yeah, yeah. I love flowers. Yeah. So you were doing the gardening. I was in because way, I was I was quitting I was I, I quit my job because I was in a very bad moment of my life and yeah. uh, I, I was searching for a new job a new job because I need to needed to pay my rent and yeah. stuff and, uh, um, and and I found this job in the in the in, in the south of Milan for as a gardener and then the the, the call from Netflix came and uh, but how did they find you that's that's the question of everybody um, how did they find you they phoned me because. Uh, they were searching for an Italian actor, and they, when they saw my picture, they, they looked at a lot of pictures, but when they got, like I'm telling you the words of the director, when yes. they got to my picture, they said, okay, he's it. It's, it's this him, is Massimo, him. it's going to be him. And uh, like, I, I didn't really accept the role at the beginning, because uh, I was good with myself, and I, I had my personal problem and stuff, and uh, the day next... Like, I just took the plane and went to, to Poland. To Poland? Yeah. Cause but you never met the director. Never. You never, never met the life. producer. I just went there and there was my contract ready. And you <laughs> went like, and right away you go nah, to I work. Called my, I, I, I called my boss from, yeah. from the garden. I'm like, hey, today I don't really feel good with my stomach, so I'm not going to come and work. <laughs> I'm not doing, and I'm like, not doing okay, the flowers Mickey, today. Yeah, yeah, and it's like, okay, Mickey, I'm going to change you with someone else. But instead, stay home with my pain. I just, yeah. I just fly to, to Poland and... The, that's what happened. Yeah, exactly. the, would you call that really destiny? Yeah. It was sometimes, destiny, huh? I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes, like, things are just made for each other, you know. Like, in when you're in the right moment, the right place, the right time, the right physical appearance, you know, it's, it's everything is right and online, and the train pass, you should get it. Exactly.